David runs an online shop. Recently, he has been receiving some negative feedback from his customers but not getting any clue about this specific product. He also receives queries but remain unaware of the products quite often. If you're running a business, you may also face the same issues as David at some point. But is there any solution available for this? Fluent Firms has an input field that's definitely gonna solve this at once and for good. Before we show you how, make sure you are subscribed to WP Manage Ninja and stay updated. Alright, let's get into it. We will pick a new blank form from the user dashboard to start with. To know who is registering a complaint or requesting a query, let's take a name and an email field. You can make these fields required so that no one can leave them empty. Moreover, users have to attach a well-formatted email while submitting the form. Now, we should bring the desired field to our form and it's the post or CPT selection input field. It's in the advanced fields, let's bring it on the form. Well, time to customize it according to your taste. We will start with the element label. Since David runs an online shop, we will rename it as the select the product. Making it required will deny entry if anyone wants to submit the form without selecting a product. Just select yes and done. An error message might be helpful for the customer, so allow us to add one. Next, we will choose the post type. For that, hit the select post type option and a drop down will appear in front. The number of options in the drop down will vary depending on the amount of the installed plugins or the kind of services you provide. Just pick the one that matches your criteria. Here, we will go with the product. You can choose one from the list by default, but if you want to show multiple criteria, then you have to use extra query parameter. We will provide the documentation in the description box. Time to set up the submit button. Let's rename the button text and tick on any of three options to set the button size. Finally, change the alignment to center. You can do many more things from the button style option as well. Well, the moment has arrived. Let's press the preview button now. As you can see, we are on the right track and anyone can select a product from the list. Most importantly, they can't submit the form unless they select one. With that, we are ready with our form. Have you created yours? You know, the simpler the better and David definitely has an easy and simple solution to his problem. Stay connected with us and who knows, you might end up finding a solution to every WordPress related issue you have.